Hey guys, it's me, Drew, and I'm here to do a Bath & Body Works haul. I went to Bath & Body Works this Saturday to see if they had any of the new pumpkin preview candles, and they didn't. So, I didn't really know exactly what to get, so I just got body care. Um, I'll start off with the free items. I had two free travel size items. So, I got a white mango chill and the coconut water chill travel size lotions. The white mango chill to me smells like a mango. I mean, definitely just like a straight up mango. Like a smoothie. You can smell like like milk, ice, chips, just like a very smoothie like summery mango. And then I also got a free um, big full-size coconut water chill shower gel. And the notes on this, because um, I had a free item if you spent $10. And this was coconut water, iced acai berry, watery melon frozen with jasmine petals and Madagascar vanilla. And to me, I get the berry and the coconut mostly. It's pretty good. I liked it. Then I purchased a loofah. I got a lime green one, and I got a white one that has like a cheetah print string, and that one's in my shower right now. That's which one I'm currently using. But this one's very, very, very nice. I kind of really like that one. Um, then I have... Um, I bought one candle, which I wasn't even planning on, but um, this girl Jen which I know if she's watching these videos, she watches all my videos. Hi, Jen. Hi, Brandy. Hi, Carissa. And um, she told me that she has a candle in the back for $4.75. So she goes, do you want it? I'm like, yeah, I'll take it, whatever. I don't care. It's probably something good. And it was a Cafe Alehi candle. And this says, a fragrance inspired by dreamy mornings, drinking coffee in a Parisian cafe, warm caramel, brown sugar, and creamy vanilla. Now, I've had all three. This one, sweet macaron and French baguette. But whenever I don't have any of those left, the only one I have is like espresso bar that's similar to a coffee scent. So I was very happy to find one. And I told her I wasn't going to buy it unless it had, unless the labels were perfect and the wicks were perfectly centered, which they are. And this smells really good. Um, it's caramel. There's a lot of caramel and some coffee and vanilla. Like, it's not like espresso bar at all. It's so much better than espresso bar. Like, I like this one 900% better than espresso bar. This one's super, super good. And it's my favorite color, orange. So, I probably won't even burn this. I just wanted it because it was a good price. And I like the smell. They also had their full-size hand sanitizers on sale. Two for $8 instead of $5 a piece. So I picked up a Sweet Pea because you can always have Sweet Pea and I really like their full-size hand sanitizers. I keep one in the bathroom and then one in my room in case, and well, two in the bathroom, one scented and then one unscented. Before I wash my face in the morning and at night, I just do a pump of that just to get every single thing off without just fully washing my hands. And then the one in my bedroom I just use all the time. So Sweet Pea is nice to have. I haven't tried that in hand sanitizer full size yet. Then I got the Summer Escape, and the Summer Escape is really good. It reminds me of the unscented hand sanitizer, but there's a little bit of a freshness to it outdoorsy, which is really, really, really good. Then I purchased a soap sleeve because I'm obsessed with owls, which I'm sure everybody knows. And I got it, and it has owls with little pumpkins. It says Bath and Body Works down there. It has a tree on the front and the back with some pumpkins, then another tree. Then I purchased three deep cleansing hand soaps from the Over the Rainbow collection. I purchased Apple Mango, and these were only $3, so pretty good deal. Lemon Daisy. And Wild Berry Freesia. Then I also purchased those three hand sanitizers. So I'll start off with my absolute favorite, which is the Wild Berry Freesia. And I'm actually going to go ahead and look up the descriptions for these online so I can tell you everything about them. This one is really, really good, though. I really like this one. Um, um, the manager, Jen, in the store told me that this smells just like blueberries 
And this one says, Wildberry Freesia, a luscious blend of juicy wild berries, purple freesia, and candied violets. For me, they're hand soaps. They don't all smell the same, but they all have like the same base, which is that alcoholy scent. But this one to me smells really, really, really good. Um, I definitely get a lot of the berryness. And then just a tiny, tiny little bit of a violet, like of a, a little bit of a floral, but it's not overpowering floral at all. It's really, really good. I really like that one. So that was the Wild Berry Freesia. The next one is Apple Mango. And this one's awesome too. And this one says... Apple Mango, a vibrant blend of green apple, exotic mango, and fresh pineapple nectar. Um, I'm not really getting a whole lot out of the hand sanitizer, so let me go ahead and try the hand soap. So much more. It's like a bright green apple, and um, just like, I, that's all I really get from it is a bright green apple. I don't get any pineapple or any mango in it. Then... Another one that I really, really like is the Lemon Daisy, obviously, because I bought hand soaps in all three. A freshly squeezed lemon, yellow daisies, and sunflowers. Now, to me, both the hand sanitizer and the soap have a same little, not just a lemon, like something else. So it must be the sunflower in it because it's really, really, really good. I'll have to pull out my Yankee Candle sunflower jar and see if that is that note that I'm getting. Then, Strawberry Hibiscus, and this one says, Luscious Strawberries, Hibiscus Flowered, and Red Sugar Cane. And to me, all this smells like is a floral, sugary, sweet strawberry. It's not all that great. I'm really not even a big fan of it, which I thought I would love it because I love strawberries, but I don't. Then we have Pink Berry Citrus, and this one says, Pink Raspberry, Strawberry, and Blushing Mandarin. Oh. Um, to me this smells like, I can't even think of what fruit it is. There's some type of fruit in here, but I can't think of it. I don't like this one either. It's the, it must be the strawberry that they're using in this, <gasps> I know what it smells like. By looking at the raspberry and the um, um, the um, citrus in here, this is, um, what was that one raspberry fragrance called that they had? I can't even remember. Let me see if it's still online. Probably not. Yes, it is. Raspberry Pink Peony. This smells like the Raspberry Pink Peony. I loved that one, but I don't like this one. It's a little bit different. Then, Passion Fruit Fig, and this one says, Passion Fruit, Fresh Fig, and Sparkling Tangerine. This one isn't bad, but I feel like they could have added more fig to it, because I kind of like the smell of their fig. And then the last one, I thought I would love, but I absolutely hate, 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 is the Peach Poppy. And this one says, A Happy Blend of Juicy Peach, Poppy Petals, and Orange Tea. Ugh. It reeks. It's almost like that tea is like a sour tea or something because this is not good at all. This is nasty. Ugh, that's horrible. Now, if you remember in my older videos when I bought like 10 Island Margarita room sprays. Remember that? Well, for semi annual so this year they had Island Margarita hand soap. So I went on like a couple days after semi annual sales started and they didn't have any, they were gone. And every time I went and they never had any, so I was pretty bummed. So whenever I was leaving the store with my bags yesterday, I saw some Island Margarita hand soap. Here it is, Island Margarita hand soap. Now the closest comparison that I have would be the Senorita Margarita from Philosophy. Somebody asked me, does this smell similar? Not at all. I like the Isla Margarita better, but the Senorita Margarita is really good. This, you can definitely smell an alcohol note and a salt note. Like a super salty alcohol. I actually took a shower with 
this one this morning, and it smelled so good in the shower with the salt and stuff, but then whenever you rinse it off, you can't smell it at all. I put on the coconut water gel lotion, but you can't even smell anything after you're out of the shower with this. This is more like an artificial limey type scent, and it has like a plum or something in it. I really like it. So, one Island Margarita, two Island Margarita. Let's try to put these in the frame. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't have room. Nine, ten. I got ten Island Margarita hand soaps for three dollars a piece. That would make it $30, then I use my 10 off 30 coupon, so I got all of them for $20. I'm going to put one in every single one of my bathrooms because this is literally my favorite fragrance. I will go through one of these in two weeks because it is my favorite. And I'll probably save like four or five for next year and the years after that because it is so good. It is one of my absolute favorite, favorite, favorite Bath & Body Works scents ever for soap, candles, everything. So... Now, here's the kicker. I wasn't going to buy these, but everybody else did, and I'm like, they can't be that good. Well, I went in the store. They are incredible. Now, I went in the store a couple days ago. I left my coupon. So whenever I went on Saturday, I got all six because I didn't know what I was going to do, and I love them. I'll start with my least favorite and go all the way up. So my least favorite, oh, by the way, these are the Nourishing Yogurt Shower Smoothies. Shower yourself with a rich cleansing smoothie with made with antioxidant vitamin C and E. This creamy shower smoothie with yogurt extract and exfoliating apricot seeds is a body-loving, skin-quenching treat that cleanses and nourishes to leave skin looking and feeling replenished and healthy. End your shower on a cold note. While nothing beats a hot shower, a blast of cool water right before you towel off can help put some spring into your step and give you a boost of energy. Never knew that. So this one is the Honeydew Kiwi. And by the way, these also are all available in the Nourishing Body Bar. Now, I like this one. Don't get me wrong. But I don't feel like it's super original. A honeydew scent. Like, I know it almost reminds me of cucumber melon. So nothing really out of the ordinary there. Then we have the raspberry. And these are all $15 normally, but I got them for $10. This one smells really good. It's like that zingy raspberry. They had that in the cream gel lotion as well, if you remember that. It was very, very good. Then the mango butter. This one smells really good. It smells just like I have that body butter in my um, bag right now, but um, just like a very fresh, fresh mango. Then blueberry vanilla. This one smells just like a fresh blueberry, but a vanilla, with obviously. It's like a creamy blueberry pie, almost. It's really, really good. And I love that all of these, you can definitely tell that they're smoothies, just, just by the consistency and by the um, texture and by the smell. It's really, really cool how they did this lime. Strawberry banana. Now, I would have put this one first. I really, really, really would have, but the reason why I didn't was kind of weird, but they needed more banana. This, to me, is all strawberry with a hint of banana. Just a hint. I really wish that it was more banana, because, I mean, strawberry scent, they had fresh picked strawberries. So, I really wished. And then, the number one pick of mine is pineapple papaya. Oh, my God. This one is amazing, 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 amazing. You can get, like, a, it's like a freshly sliced pineapple core, cord and everything blended into a juice. But then, then, there's, like, that papaya punch candle from Yankee Candle. Like, there's just a boom papaya smell in here. And it's so, so good. So, I actually might pick up a couple more of the strawberry banana and the pineapple papaya because they're just really good. I might pick up one more of each because... These are just an awesome line, but I probably I don't need them. I just want them. I think they're really, really cool, and they feel so good. I used the blueberry vanilla one yesterday night, and it felt pretty good. Um, 
I like them. I just wish that they sunsed it up more. Sunsed up more. But anyway, that was my Bath and Body Works haul. I know, 15 minutes. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye!